Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Every year I do a what I got for Christmas video and this year is no exception. I'm so excited to show you all of the really amazing things that I was blessed with this year. So I'm really excited to share with you guys. And as always, I never do these videos to boast or brag. I literally am just showing you in case you're looking for some gift ideas for the future, maybe you have a birthday coming up or something you just wanna treat yourself to. And these videos seem to do really well. So I know you guys enjoy watching them. I am about to head out of town so my dishwasher washer is running so I apologize if you can hear that and so far I've only opened Blake's presents so I'm gonna do these here and then I'll have another clip from a couple days from now before this video goes up for you guys on Tuesday so anyway here's all the amazing things that Blake got for me and I'm so excited to share with you guys first off are these Oops. <laughs> Adorable snow, Mickey snowman, snow, snow cones. Why can't I say this right? There they are. These adorable snow cone earrings that are Mickey shaped. And I had these on my wish list this year and I got them and I'm so thankful because they're so flipping cute. I love them so much. I love the texture in them, how they literally look like snow cones. And I'm really excited to wear these around the parks this year. Love them so much. These were on my Christmas list. If you watched my video, and look how cute how they wrap their little box with the wax seal. So adorable. Then I also got this, which was on my wish list, which is this shirt, which has Diana and Charles on it. It says men ain't shit. And I love it so much. And I think I'm going to literally wear it this week when we're out of town. And this one was from my wish list as well. And it's from Etsy as well. And then, so this one is actually funny. I forgot to include it on my Christmas wish list for the video I did for you guys, but it was on my wish list and I've had it on my list for a long time. And it is this sweater, which Princess Diana wore when she went to Disney World. And it's so cute. And this is what I got for Jordan for Christmas and Blake got me the same one. So I'm so excited to twin with her. And I just love the sweater. I think it's so cool and nostalgic and I'm so excited to wear it. It's super comfortable as well. <laughs> and then a bunch of stuff from box lunch so I sent Blake a little list from box lunch and this shirt which has C-3PO and R2-D2 on Tatooine I love it and it's so simple I think it's gonna be so cute to wear to the parks with like my red shorts or jean shorts it's just super classic and then this one this one I'm just obsessed with the red and white stripes with the poo and the poo is like embroidered it's so freaking cute and again classic simple I cannot wait to wear it to the parks and uh, I just picture that one like taking pictures with it and it's so cute Next up is this Luca shirt and I'm really really excited about this one I also had this on my list that I gave to Blake because I don't have anything Luca and it's one of my favorite Pixar movies It's probably my second favorite after Coco. I loved it so much So I'm really excited for this one And I think that this one would look really cute at Epcot for like Italy and I got it in a larger size So that way I can wear it with uh, biker shorts <laughs> and then also this which Blake picked out himself I did not have this on my list and it says spread kindness with baby Grogu and I just just love the colors. I think this one will be really cute for Festival of the Arts because it's like rainbowy. So I'll probably wear that one, but I think it's absolutely adorable. And those are all from Box Lunch. And then lastly, these cute little Winnie the Pooh socks. Ooh, I just spit. <laughs> these cute little Winnie the Pooh socks. And on the bottom, they have little honey pods. So freaking adorable. And then lastly, the grand finale of things. I cried when I opened this. Tickets to see Anastasia the musical when it comes to Florida in March. I'm so excited. If you guys didn't know, we went to New York back in 2017 when Anastasia first opened and we were on a family trip. So we all went to see Wicked, but I've always wanted to really see Anastasia. And then it went on tour and I was so excited because in 2020, I was finally gonna get to see it in August when it came to Atlanta. And of course COVID happened. So the tour got canceled and now it's back. And I can't believe I'm finally gonna get to see it in 2022. And I'm so, so excited. So I'm I'm really really thankful for that and I just feel so grateful and overwhelmed today is Christmas as I'm filming this so anyway thank you guys for watching this clip and I'll join you in a couple days for the rest of everything I got for Christmas <laughs> hello everyone it's a couple days later and I wanted to show you the rest of the things that I got Christmas and I'm currently at my in-laws house so if you hear things happening in the background there's a lot of other people in this house besides just me so I'm gonna try to film this as quickly as I can and show you all of the incredible things that we we're blessed with and hopefully you guys will benefit from this video I'm gonna go ahead and get started. I kind of organized things 
So we've had Christmas with just me and Blake with his family and with my mom's family. So we still haven't had Christmas in Miami yet. So if you want to see what we got from Miami, it's not going to be in this video. So be sure to hit the subscribe button down below to find out what items I got there because I'm pretty sure there'll be some Disney items for my dad's house. But anyway, I, um, I'm just going to show what we got here at our mom's houses. So first off, <laughs> one of the gifts was in this and all I could think of was oatmeal container, a wooden bowl, <laughs> an empty water bottle, and a paper towel roll. So I'm obsessed with my wooden bowl. I'm gonna be making some yummy salads and stuff in that. Um, <laughs> so I really liked it. Also, this angle is really bad because there's a window right behind, but there's also a bed right here. So I can't like turn this way. So uh, sorry about the curtains and everything. I'm trying my best. This is all kind of mixed together. So I'll just kind of say like where everything is from. Um, but we got some stocking stuffers from Blake's mom. These are for me, obviously, they're face masks. Although Blake does like the occasional face mask, but these were gifted. And then um, we did get a lot of personal care items. So lots of soaps in our stockings. And my mom actually purchased from this small business called Made Simple Soaps and Cloths. So from there, she got us a sugar scrub body lotion, which I tried this morning and it smells absolutely delicious. Um, and she got us something else. Oh, here it is. <laughs> Um, this one's from a different small shop called Fire Lake Soapery. And there's a coffee soap bar and a candle. So that's really cool. We love hoarding small in this family. And then um, my mother-in-law gifted this Versace perfume. And guys, we got so many smelling things this year that if I, if we meet this year, if we meet in person, you and me, and I do not smell good, just like slap me in the face because I should smell good every single day because we got so many, put right on my mouth, because we got so many delicious fragrances and soaps and we're just stocked up so I'm really excited about that but these are the Versace um, Dylan turquoise and Dylan blue and I really like the Dylan blue it's very soft and subtle and then um, my mother-in-law brought us aromatherapy essential oils um, I'm not really sure how these work I think it's for, oh, they're shower steamers. That's cool. So you put them into the shower and they steam. That's really good for like when you have a cold and stuff, I bet, to let all the like eucalyptus oil get into your nose. And then there's also an essential oil mist. So that's really neat. Um, both my mom and my mother-in-law had the same idea. So my mom gave us this. It's like the little thing you put on the air conditioning vent in your car. And my mom got me the reindeer one, which I know Christmas is over, but I'm so excited to use it next year because it's absolutely adorable. And with that, she got the smell sweater weather. And then my mother-in-law got me a regular one, black one. And there's two scents in here. I don't know if I can see them. Oh, here we go. Mahogany teakwood and black cherry merlot. Really delicious one. And also a hand sanitizer because, you know, we can always use that this time of our lives. And these, which are some of my most favorite stocking stuffers ever. It is these plant-based pens. And I just love the colors on them. Like, I'm literally so excited to use them. I'm a very simple person. I love small things like this. So they just look like so soothing and I can't wait to use these. <laughs> we also got this little towel, which I think is for your hair to wrap it up. And then this little Monopoly game, which my mother-in-law and father-in-law got for us and it's Monopoly and Monopoly Madness and I'm really excited to play it because Blake and I have a tradition of playing Monopoly every Christmas Eve and we really love Monopoly so I'm excited to try these and see if it's easier like you don't have to keep track of all your money and all of that stuff so that'll be really fun to try out as well we also got well not we I should say me um, my mom gave this to me so this wasn't really a Christmas present but it didn't fit her so she gave it to me and it's a romper and usually rompers are too short for my booty but this one surprisingly fits really well and it's from Shein. I do not support Shein. I just want to make that clear. Shein is very bad for the environment. They steal from small artists. So I just want to put that out there, but I think my mom thrifted this, but Shein is where it's from. I think she got it a long time ago, but it's um, it actually fits me and I'm excited to wear it. And I think it'd be perfect for an Animal Kingdom day. So that's the plan right now when I'm going to wear that. <laughs> also, my mother-in-law got us some cute little, I keep saying us, but these are for me. They wouldn't even fit Blake, but it's these socks and they say, drop it like like a sloth, which is so cute. And it has little sloths on it. And also these, which I absolutely love, which is a llama blowing bubble gum. And I just love the pink colors and the llama's head is really
really fluffy, so it's super adorable. We've also been gifted some beautiful candles. So this one actually my mom gave to me because she um, has a very sensitive nose and she doesn't like the smell of pine. She likes it, but she can't because it makes her sneeze. So this is a ginormous candle, which will last us a very long time. So love that one. And I love the smell of pine, it's so delicious. And then these I'm so excited about. They are the wooden wick candles and I love crackling candles. They smell, well, not that they smell, I'm sure they smell delicious, but the sound of them is like the most comforting thing to sit down on a couch with my book and a crackling candle and a cup of tea. It's like the perfect day in my opinion. Add a little charcuterie board, some chocolate chip cookies. I might get teary eyed just thinking about it. But these are from Target and one is vanilla and bergamot and one is coconut and honey. And they both smell delicious. I've smelled both of them. So really excited to try those. As far as food goes, we got a lot like of candy and stuff. We've eaten a lot of it. But one of the things that my mother-in-law got for Blake was this diet energy soda stream. And our soda stream we love so much, but we ran out of the car, the CO2. So we need to go get some of that because it's so much better than like buying LaCroix and stuff in my opinion because we don't have recycling at my apartment complex so it's nice to be able to be more eco-friendly so we need to go get that but Blake loves energy drinks so this is a diet energy drink with caffeine and vitamins so I know he'll love that. I don't drink energy drinks I can't do caffeine because of my mental health issues but I know that he's really gonna enjoy that because he loves like Celsius like the healthy energy drinks. My mom got us these so Kilwins um, is like a it's there's multiple locations but it's like kind of our thing when we come here to our hometown in Stewart, Florida to go to Kilwins and get ice cream and they have like chocolate covered pretzels and chocolate covered Oreos and all kinds of delicious treats. So I know these are gonna be absolutely delicious. There's so many different kinds. And my mom just gifted us some cash this year, which was so nice because we're trying to save for a house. So she kind of just put it in here, which was nice <laughs> in a card. Like I always say, I am i don't share gift cards or cash information because that's not really what this video is about, but we're really blessed every time that we get one. So thank you to everybody who got us those because we are saving for a house right now and it's really really helpful but kind of going off the gift card theme the one gift card I will talk about is Blake's brother's girlfriend oops got us this and I have to be honest it was filled with so many more goodies like gummies and pretzels and Oreos not Oreos Sour Patch Kids but we ate pretty much all of it already but there's still Lindor truffles which love those and some popcorn and she put a little Fandango gift card in here and I just think that's the most clever idea ever and this popcorn bowl we'll definitely use in the future so I love that idea I thought it was very very clever and cute and then my brother-in-law got me this little pot not a pot it's actually a plant <laughs> <laughs> and it's for amaryllis minerva bulbs. So I'm really excited to grow some more plants. I actually just planted watermelon. Um, so I've been really, really loving growing plants. I have way too many plants now and it's all because of my sister. So <laughs> she's taught me everything I know. Every time I have an infestation or something horrible, I call her. And so I'm really excited to grow a new plant. I think that'll be so much fun. Also our sister-in-law, well, my sister-in-law, his sister, got us these amazing handmade. They're over there. I didn't bring them over. Let me go bring them over. Okay, she brought us these. They are handmade, handmade simple syrup, which has vanilla bean, I think she said, um, a bunch of herbs. I don't really remember all the herbs, but all kinds of cool things. I think it has like orange and stuff like that, which I think would make a really good old fashioned for Blakey Bear. And then she also made us this, which is a color changing lavender syrup, which is gonna be delicious in my gin drinks. I'm thinking like gin and some elderflower in this, it's gonna be delicious. So I just think it's really cool that she took the time to make these and I'm really excited to try them. I think today, we're actually gonna go to the liquor store and get like something to try to mix them because I think that'll be so much fun. And then lastly, the last couple of things I wanted to share. So my mother-in-law gifted us this Groupon, which is for a fluid art class for two, which I'm so excited about. It's basically like the art where it's like a canvas and then you pour paint on it and you like use like a hair dryer and like it's super abstract. But I just think it'd be super fun with Blake and I. And I think it's like the kind of thing where you can like bring a bottle of wine, which I just think is a really fun date night. I think Groupon are such a great idea because you're gifting experiences and then you know that they're gonna be able to enjoy that gift together so really excited to do this I'm gonna convince Blake to go with me and then this one which I'm so overwhelmed by my sister-in-law and her and her boyfriend I should say did not need to do this but they did they called me tickets to go see Frozen I cannot believe it right, I guess it's coming to Orlando in like February or March or something like that because she said it was close to my birthday so I'm so overwhelmed that I'm gonna get to see Frozen and Anastasia this year and we have tickets 
tickets to go see Ali and AJ and we're going to a magic game all like within February through May. So I'm just feeling so overwhelmed and grateful. And I feel like 2022 is just gonna be a year full of new experiences and I'm so thankful for that. So I cannot thank her enough for these tickets. It was so nice. And I'm just overwhelmed with gratefulness for everything that we received this year. And I'm just super, super grateful. And it's really nice to spend time with my family. Um, <laughs> I've only talked to a few people about this, but there's a lot going on in my life right now, um, which is why I've been kind of absent this December. It's just so nice to take a break from work and to be with our families and all of these gifts are just so generous and we just feel very, very lucky and blessed. So anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed seeing everything I got for Christmas this year. Like I said, we still haven't done Christmas with my dad. So if you want to see that, it might be in this week's vlog because we're going down there on Wednesday. So we'll see. Um, otherwise, it's going to be on my channel at some point. So be sure to hit the subscribe button down below to check out those things and all the fun Disney stuff we're going to do this next year. I'm so excited and I hope you all are having a wonderful, wonderful holiday season. Happy New Year and I'll see you real soon. Bye guys. I'm pulling my camera back out because I forgot to say that our friends from work also gifted us this little Funko mini. I didn't even know that they made those and it's so cute. I love Dumbo. I love elephants. I love Minnie Mouse. So it's absolutely adorable. I'm so thankful. And then Jordan was so nice and got me the popcorn lounge fly ears. Can't believe it. She tracked them down for me. We went, there's a vlog somewhere around there where Jordan and I went to Hollywood Studios and I was looking at the popcorn ears. I really wanted them, but I was like, no, I'm going to save the money. And they sold out everywhere. And she was looking for them for me, looking for them for me, and she finally found them. So I'm really excited. Those are on the way and I'm just so thankful for everybody. I feel so blessed. Anyway, thank you guys. Bye.